I wasn't always a believer. The first time I went squatching, I was still in college, so I didn't believe in anything. Liberal arts will do that to a person. <laughs> Booked on a whim when I took a sociology course. Should make a fascinating study. Break rules around, and I feel a bit of buyer's remorse. Because I should have brought a buddy. Here I am on the squatch mobile. Seven sweaty men in a heavy duty truck. I close my eyes and pretend it isn't real. I'm out of luck. But while I'm one of the gang, I might as well get the bang for my buck. And it's hard to believe that these men get time off work for this. It's hard to believe, but it's all they want to do. So we reach the trailhead and start the hike, and the whole way in, they are talking strategy. The best ways to guarantee a Swatch sighting. The whole thing is ridiculous, and it's also pretty fun. You hit a tree with a stick, and the Squatch will understand that you're strong. That wasn't mentioned in the email. Then learn the in by performing in his favorite song. That's more effective if you're female. All the guys have their own techniques, trying every kind of call a beaver to a duck. Seems to me we can stay out here for weeks. Cause it's hard to believe, but I'm actually enjoying this. It's hard to believe, but I understand the charm. how it goes for three more nights. I wish I'd given them the benefit of the doubt because they are genuinely kind people who just happen not to shave or shower very often. But I get where they're coming from. These trips are fun because even when you fail, you fail together. And by the last night, you decide you've done enough squatching for one trip. So the boys bust out the bourbon and we smoke a few cigars. Satisfied we haven't seen a thing. Once everyone's asleep, I take a walk beneath the stars. I'm feeling sentimental, so I sing. Sasquatch, Sasquatch, I wanted to ask, watching the world from the woods, does it make his favorite song, but it feels right in the moment. <laughs> and suddenly, I start to see all the signs they taught me to watch for. All around me are snapped branches and stripped tree bark. And out of the darkness, I finally notice two yellow glowing eyes staring at me. Eventually the sun comes up and we have to start the hike back. And as we leave those woods, I resolve to dedicate the rest of my life to finding the truth. Cause it's hard to believe, but that's real. 